Hi, welcome to my channel. This is me, my name is Nikki, and welcome to a couple days of my life as an extremely overworked student. Hi guys. It's Friday, January 24th. It's like 2.30 and I just finished all my classes. But I do have some errands to run. So first I need to return this package. And also I need to stop by Walgreens again to get something. But yeah. Hello, hello. I just got back in my dorm and this is so random, but um, usually my jeans are like too long on me. Like you can tell even these, they're kind of long. But the other day I got safety pins and I learned how to like use these on my jeans to shorten them. And now look at the back of these jeans. They actually fit me. And now they don't like drown through the snow or anything. So I'm honestly pretty proud that I finally did that. I do have a busy like weekend ahead. So I'm gonna get as much homework done tonight as I can. My Fridays are usually pretty chill and they're not too busy. The way I schedule my classes was so that Monday and Tuesday would be really, really chill. I maybe have one or two classes on each day. And then Wednesdays and Thursdays, I have like three to four classes every day, which kind of sucks because I start the day at like maybe around 10 and I have like back-to-back -back classes and I end the day at close to like 4 p.m., which isn't ideal. And then on Fridays, I only have like two classes, I believe. So the busiest days of my week are definitely Wednesday and Thursday, which I might change in the coming years. Hello, hello. I've been working on my code for like about an hour-ish now at this point. And I am, I'm actually so annoyed right now. Like it works, just compile. <laughs> I don't know why, like I, I'm just very annoyed. Um, so I'm gonna go eat with some friends. And after dinner, I promised another friend that I'd go help her on this exact same coding project. So that's kind of like my little plans for the day. I went into my friend's room to help her get started on the coding project because we're taking like the same engineering class. It's intro to data structures and algorithms. And we don't have like the same lecture times, lab times, or the same professor, but since we're taking the same class, we have the same project to do. And after I helped her get started, I decided to stay in the room and work on my own project as well. And it was also during this time that I realized I had been doing my entire project just completely wrong. We were given multiple files to work on, and for some reason, I didn't know that, and I just thought we had one file we were supposed to work on. So I wrote all my code onto one file, wondering why it wasn't compiling and running, even though all the code was right. It's okay though, I ended up figuring it out and doing good on the project. Hi guys, it's like 12.30 a.m. right now. I don't know where the day went. <laughs> I spent like too long hanging out with friends. Originally I was supposed to help with my friends with their homework and that I was supposed to work on homework for the rest of the day, but we kind of got distracted, which was to be expected. That always happens when you're in friend groups. That was that, but I haven't had like a decent night's sleep. When I say a decent night's sleep, I just mean like eight full hours of sleep. I have not been getting that for a couple days. So since it's a Friday night, I think I'm just gonna head to bed right now. I have so much work I need to get done, but I'm gonna head to bed, recharge, get as much sleep as I want, and then spend all of Saturday locking in to get my work done. Good morning everyone. I just woke up and it's like a little bit past nine, but I just checked YouTube studio and all my watch hours have processed and I am now officially monetized. So I just wanted to thank you guys so, so, so much. And I appreciate every single one of you guys, but I'm super excited. So I'm gonna hop onto my laptop and do all my like ad stuff. Even as I'm editing this video, I still can't believe I've achieved such a huge milestone. YouTube is completely just a hobby and creative outlet for me, 
So I just wanted to thank every single one of you guys for joining my community and staying here and supporting me. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys so, so, so much. I was so excited about being like fully monetized that I think I spent a good hour or two or three just looking through all my videos and all the ad placements and everything and just seeing what that was like. Hello, hello. It is almost 11 now, it's 10.55 and I have such a busy day ahead. Like this is not even okay. And it's not even busy in like the fun sense where like I have a bunch of stuff I need to go to. I literally just have so much stuff I need to get done today. And there's also like stuff I have to go to as well. So it's 11 now. I'm part of the Society of Women Engineers and there is an event today that I'm, I'll be volunteering at. I have to be there from 11.45 to 3.30 and that's already a big chunk of my day. And then after that, me and a friend decided to get together because we have like a coding assignment that we wanted to do together. So we need to do that. Okay, the stuff I have planned for today. One, the coding project with my friend. Two, I'm taking an entrepreneurship class and I need to do the homework for this week. Three, I have online math homework. Four, I have a math quiz that I need to do for the week. And I think there's two online math homeworks, but I'm still gonna count that as one thing. Uh, five, for one of my engineering classes, I need to make my resume and it'll be graded, so it needs to be a good resume. Six, oh, this is actually higher priority. I have a coding project. It's an individual coding project that's due on Monday that I've been working on for the past couple days. I just need to debug like one more thing and then write a couple test cases. I'm expecting that to take like an hour-ish. Seven, I have um, for one of my clubs, there's like this thing I have to complete for it to be able to like go, uh, work in the workshops and stuff. I need to get that done. Then eight, for SWE, the Society of Women Engineers. Um, again, I'm planning like an event. So I need to get, I need to ma finish making the slides and the worksheet for that. So that's eight. That's all the stuff I have planned for today. But I think there's more stuff I want to do because I don't want to do them on Sunday. Wish me luck. All right, I just finished volunteering. Also, I got a little bit of work done in there as well, but I was starving, we didn't get that much food. So before I go do any more work, I'm heading to the dining hall right now so I can grab like a quick lunch or something. It is 5.48 and this is what I mean when I say that some days I just like blink and it's the end of the day and I'm getting ready for night because it's like 6 p.m. It's almost 6 p.m. and it's not like night time yet. I usually wind down a bit later in the day but it's, it's very close to winding down time and I have not had like free time like all day but I refuse to go to bed tonight unless I have like basically everything I want to get done actually done so and and my to-do list has changed like a little bit already <laughs> first originally i was gonna do a coding project with a friend um i texted him like three hours ago and he still hasn't responded quite worried because i think he might still be asleep but that's fine because the project isn't actually due anytime soon to be on track we should finish it by next week so there's still time for that and I finished the events that I was supposed to plan for SWE. I finished the slides and the worksheet earlier today. So I finished those two. And I guess I just have everything else. Yeah, I don't really know exactly what order I want to do them in. I'll probably just go off vibes if, if that makes sense. One of my main goals for this semester that's like education slash school related was to be more involved in my community. So like joining more clubs and actually participating in them as well as joining like project teams and stuff. I've since realized that that is actually a lot more time consuming than I thought, but I'm still going strong. Hi guys. 
It's 9.13. I don't even remember when I recorded the last clip, but I'm assuming it's been a couple hours. And that was not actually that productive. Um, I did get a couple of stuff done. I did my entrepreneurship homework and also uh, redid my resume, like redid the entire thing and I turned that in. But these days my form of procrastination has just been editing YouTube videos, which is really funny to say because instead of homework, sometimes I just really want to relax and just creatively use my brain instead of just doing like straight STEM all day because that's a lot of what my homework and classes are. And I used to relax by like going on my phone, reading, naps, just staring off into space, just random stuff, journaling even, planning and all that. And these days, I have been doing all of those less and instead just editing videos a lot more, which is really convenient because I edit videos on my laptop and I usually always have my laptop with me. But yeah, I didn't even finish editing a video either. I just edited a little bit of a video. But yeah, it kind of makes me excited that this is, the, this is what I find relaxing because technically I'm still being productive when I edit a video. And I also, um, I've recently been posting like longer content because I used to do a lot of day in the lives. So just a lot of, I would record one day, edit one day and then post that. And one day's worth of content was usually around like 10 to 20 minutes, depending on what I did in the day. But these days I, I've decided that I think it would be a lot more entertaining if I recorded multiple days at once. Just in case I have like a boring day, there's still another day to add more content to it. But then as I recorded, I found that those videos end up being like three minutes or more. Um, so I'm just experimenting with a lot of my styles right now. And I don't know, I'll see which ones perform best. I'll see which ones you guys end up liking. If you guys have a preference, feel free to comment it. I would love to hear what you guys think. We're going through the experimental phase of my channel right now. But now I gotta get back to homework because I still have a lot to do. Hi! It is currently 10.30ish and I've been doing nothing since the last clip so I think it's been like an hour-ish I believe. I have lost motivation to do my homework but I do have so much stuff I still need to get done. I think I'm gonna go take a shower, come back to do my math, do some coding, and then I'll probably call it a night. I might check my to-do list again but let's be productive! All right, it's 11.38 right now, and I'm gonna get started on my math homework. I remember in high school, I used to be so productive and like locked in at night, and I would stay up until like 3 a.m. every single day doing homework, and I would like not be affected. I would just have caffeine in the morning. But now that I'm in college, I'm so unproductive at night, and I find myself so productive early in the morning when like the sun's still out and I'm all energized and stuff. I don't know why. And also, now that I'm in college, I love being an early bird. I love waking up like when the sun rising or sometimes even before the sunrise. But I just love it when I'm awake and there's sun on me. And then getting my work done when there is still like light out feels so amazing. Rather than cooping up in my room in the middle of the night when it's dark out and having to use artificial light. I, I don't know why. The sun just makes me so happy these days. And that was not a thing in high school for me. Hello, hello. It is 2.13 a.m. I am a bit tired now. Actually, no, I'm, I'm kind of in the mood to do things, but I know I will be tired tomorrow, so I need to go to bed now. But I spent like the past hour editing a really, really, really long YouTube video, and it's like not even near done. So I'm, I'm not feeling the most productive right now, but I also got some homework done. I finished my math quiz I realized I already did this week's homework. Uh, the next homework that's open is for next week and we haven't learned the content yet, so that's fine. I mainly finished my coding project, but I think I'll just look over it again tomorrow just to make sure everything works fine and stuff. Yeah, I, I did a decent amount today. I think everything that I absolutely need to get done is done, but I also saved quite a bit of work for tomorrow as well. But that's okay. Like. The beginning of the week is usually just slower for me just because I have less classes like Monday and Tuesday. So I'll get Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday to like try to get ahead for the rest of the week. And hopefully I'm not as swamped next week as I was this week. But yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow morning.
Since it was Sunday morning and I didn't really have any events I absolutely needed to go to until later in the day, I kind of just did work on my bed for a couple hours and the work in question was just editing a YouTube video and not my homework. Usually I like to set aside time during one day of the weekend so that I can at least have one day where I can just rest and relax and recharge for the rest of the week because my weekdays are usually really busy and filled. But I had quite a bit of work to do this week and due to my procrastination, including what I'm doing right now, I still had quite a bit of work to do. Hello, hello. It is 11.30 right now and I've literally spent all morning trying to finish editing a YouTube video, which I'm still not done with, but I don't think I'll be spending any more time like in the morning or afternoon doing that. First, I have to get ready for the day. I like haven't brushed my teeth or anything. And then I'm gonna grab some food and I have a club meeting from one to four. And after that, I'm gonna try to get some homework done. It's It should be a pretty chill day. Homework isn't like hard. It's not really like brain consuming, except for my coding project. You know what? I'm gonna shut up. I'll be doing homework later. Hello, hello. A friend was actually supposed to come to this meeting with me, but he literally texted me like 10 minutes ago and was like, he has a lot of homework that he expected to get done, but it's still not done yet. So he's gonna skip out on this meeting. So now I'm an independent woman in STEM walking to this club meeting alone. Ooh. I'm back in my dorm now and I think there's half an hour before the dining hall reopens again for dinner because it's like four and I promised a friend I would go watch the football game with him it's the Eagles and the Commanders game and I don't think I'll be able to watch it with him at least not the full game but I'm gonna go stop in his room for like half an hour and then go grab food and then come back and do some work It is 5.50 and I just got back from dinner. I'm not going to talk too much because I've been editing a lot of my more recent videos and I realized that I yap too much, it makes my videos boringer and it just draws it out and it's harder to edit. So I'm going to shut up and get started on homework. I am very much a person who just works based on my mood. So even for like reading, I'm definitely a mood reader. Sometimes I'm just in the mood for specific things and sometimes I'm not in the mood for specific things. And unfortunately, that also applies to school and homework for me as well. I just get bursts of motivation throughout the day, or sometimes it's like bursts of motivation throughout the week, where there are days that I'm just feeling unproductive, I don't want to get anything done. But like, being like a mood student is not, is not a good or smart thing to do. I need to find some way to like, be productive, even when I'm not feeling like it. It is 8.25, and... I got a bit of stuff done. I'm mostly done with my coding project. I just have one little bug. I can't seem to debug. I spent like an hour on it and I can't figure it out. So I took a little break and edited a YouTube video. I finished editing that. So I just need to make thumbnails for it. But yeah, I have a bit more work, but I might just take a little break, take a shower and then get back to homework. Hi. It's been a bit since the last clip. It is 11.39 and I finished taking a shower, I finished my nighttime routine and everything. I am quite ready for bed, but I think I'm gonna try to get some more work done. I wouldn't say any of it is due, like tomorrow or anytime like soonish, but there's just like no end to the amount of stuff I need to get done. There, like, it is an endless pile, no matter how much I get done in a day, there's just an endless pile. So I think I'm gonna try to get a little bit of stuff done before I actually head to bed, but that'll maybe be like an hour or two. Yeah, I ended up staying up until around two, but thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more content. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.